New tonight at 8. Well, today was supposed to be opening day of skiing for those folks going to Heavily Mountain Resort, but that did not happen. Extreme winds forced the closure of the mountain. Crown Forest J.R. Stone is in South Lake Tahoe with more on what exactly actually proved to be an exciting day anyway. If you were just driving through the South Lake Tahoe area, you probably see the snow on the ground and say, wow, skiing conditions must be good. Well, not so much. At Heavenly Mountain Resort, high winds meant no opening day. Closed, meaning no excitement on the hill. Just on camera. So you expected to be one of the first on the hill and yodel on the hill. Yes, I was. I was going, you know, but I couldn't do that today, so I'm sorry. No need to be sorry. All of those who showed up early could use a yodel. In fact, Anne is so into yodeling and skiing, she has her own special yodel doll with her. You know you're the first person I've ever interviewed that is yodel. Oh, wow. I hope I'm not going to be the last one because the yodeling is makes you happy. To a reporter who's been in the midst of 30 mile an hour wind gusts day and night, wind gust comes in and deep in research right now temperatures according to my instruments nothing like a good yodel to go with the beauty and chill of Tahoe we know there are only a few lifts open but diehards do stupid things when you're skiing <laughs> don't worry he's not talking about our yodel extraordinaire Rather, those who showed up several hours early to be first on the mountain. They give they give out swag to the first hundred. First hundred and fifty, get, get a free prize. Shirts, hats, and even cowbells were given out. There we go. <laughs> but nothing here. Not the white snow and not even the mountain are nearly as good as yes. Take it, Sweden. I want to hear one more yodel. Okay. Yolahudi, yolahudi. I love it. In Tahoe, J.R. Stone, Cronfor News.